The following program will guide you through the process of loading the Shelter Support Unit or SSU trailer. This is a unique trailer that requires each item to be placed in its designated location. Every inch counts. Starting with the gray bins with medical supplies, they should be placed in their respective color and number slot. The cots need to be loaded under the rack with the gray medical bins. Be sure you leave a space open for the orange vital sign monitor cases. The cots need to be loaded in a staggered manner in order to fit in their appropriate spot. The last four cots are placed on top of the wheel well. To secure the cots in place, the orange rods are put in place. In the foot well of the side door, two fire extinguishers are placed on their side and covered by a wooden platform to create a flat surface. The nose wall should be loaded next with the oxygen cart secured to the wall using the E-tracks. Start with the red oxygen cart, then orange, blue, green, finishing with the yellow. Next, one walker is placed in the mount on the rack. The others are placed in the designated colored wall mount. Each oxygen cart is loaded with short and long crutches, canes, and seat collar marked with the designated colors. The two portable toilets with stands are then placed between the oxygen carts and the rack. The two green color coated raven litter stands are placed against the wall and the rolling vital monitor pedestals are placed in front. The final two yellow color coated litter stands are then placed on top of the feet of the rolling pedestals. Now the nose wall of the trailer is completed with the yellow color coated equipment available to be removed first. Next. Secure the extra long ratchet strap to the rack in preparation for loading the boxes containing the linens. The linen boxes are stacked one on top of the other, pushing them forward against the oxygen carts. Once loaded, a partner will hand you the other end of the strap that is secured to the rack so you can tighten the upper boxes in place. The three green color-coded privacy screens are then secured to the rack in preparation for loading the large blue racks containing the beds. The beds need to be staggered in order to fit all 10 of them in the rolling blue racks. Once loaded, each rolling rack should be covered. The easiest way to place the rack on the ramp is to grasp the crossbar and lift slightly. It is best to use two personnel to push the rack up the ramp, keeping it tight to the right side. Three rolling blue racks are loaded into the trailer in preparation for loading the red patient care carts. The red patient care cart that is color-coded green with the refrigerator on top is then loaded with the drawer side facing the wall. Next, the patient care cart with the green color coated microwave on top is loaded in a similar manner with the drawer side facing the wall. The small box of sea foam towels is placed on top of the refrigerator. The box containing the four green color coated chairs is placed in between the refrigerator and the microwave. The two color coded privacy screens are loaded vertically between the side wall and the refrigerator. In front of the two privacy screens, both pack and plays are stacked, one on top the other. Next, the green tables are placed vertically between the sidewall and the carts. The mop bucket is placed on top of the microwave, and the box with the two green and two yellow color-coded chairs is placed in front of the microwave. The next rolling blue rack of beds is placed in the trailer. Next, the red patient care cart with the yellow color-coded microwave is put in place with the drawers facing the side wall. Then place the shop back on top of the microwave and the three yellow color coated tables vertically between the wall and the cart. Then the two backboards are placed in front of the tables and the last yellow color coated privacy screen is loaded horizontally between the backboards on top of the tables. The last red patient care cart with the refrigerator is loaded with the drawers facing the side walls. The last box of four yellow color-coded chairs is placed between the microwave and the refrigerator. The stack of trash cans is loaded on the top of the boxes of chairs, placing the two water coolers horizontally on top of the refrigerator. Then, the last rolling rack of beds is put in place. The mop, broom, tool kit, 
and remaining ratchet straps are placed between the cart and the trailer wall. The two stretchers in the black bags and the four load bars are then secured to the end of the rack. The two cable covers are then placed by the broom and the rear ramp is shut. At the side door, the wheelchair legs are placed on the floor under the rack. Secure the circuit breakers and place the power cord on the wall hanger. Then, four of the wheelchairs are placed in front of the linen boxes with the last wheelchair placed on top. Finally, close and secure the side door.